And then just in front of them, Matcher and, and Jaden will be just slightly behind Victor. So, 4 3. 3 4 3. 3 4 3. Yep, yeah, there we are. Wolves getting us underway, kicking from right to left in this first half. He's just standing at right angles to the ball and steps up. Left footed, does go for goal. Easy for either side. Chipped forward, decent ball in behind. The goalkeeper comes, Joe Whitworth, and gets there at the feet of Chiwomi. Be accurate towards Victor Akinwali. Now Jaden Raymond has got it, can shift it out towards that left-hand side. Taken out the sky very nicely. Good work from uh, Jack Wells Morrison. He did, did remarkably well. In fact, it was just in. The ball's going to be teased in. Danny. And there's the opening goal. Great. Brilliant finish from Danny Imre, getting into the 18-yard box. And finishing like an experienced striker. One touch to control and then knocking it round the goalkeeper. What a start. Palace ahead. 15 minutes played. It's Crystal Palace 1. Wolves nil. Excellent. Really, really good play. Good, but I thought this was just a little bit too high. You can see that just, just, just managed to keep it in. Plays, follows, creates a space, coming inside. Danny getting in, round the back. Exactly what the manager wants the uh, the wing backs to do: get in the, into the far post or into the penalty area and get yourself on on the end of some crosses. Really well done, well taken as well, Danny, because it wasn't easy. Barnett takes half a dozen steps back and then looks to try and bend it round the wall. Joe Whitworth comfortably in behind it. Hasn't looked totally assured so far. Rashawn plays the ball into the six-yard box. It's hit the underside of the bar. Has it crossed the line? Oh. That's the big question. I'm not sure it did, in fairness. Wanting to get there, making sure that he got there. Up against two players. Very good from him, Ray. Turning, still going. Fine. Playing the ball across goal. It might fall here for Jaden Raymond. Raymond goes back to Grant. Grant with a looping effort. Ball knocked out towards this right-hand side. The chance for Coletta to come forward into the 18-yard box. He comes. Coletta teases one towards the back post. To, um, into the, into the, uh, the centre-half. Jaden Ray Danny. to Danny Imray. Imray goes for goal. Oh, <laughs> scored the second. What a beauty that is. Danny Imray from range. Got there ahead of the goalkeeper, who probably, in hindsight, made the wrong decision coming. None of that matters. The only thing that does is that Imre scored a second. Palace are 2-0 up. Joyous scenes at the VBS Community Stadium. Well, excellent play. Good little ball through. Danny running off the shoulder again. Where's the goalkeeper going? Where did he start? Where was his start position? But he gets it all wrong. The ball pitches. You can just see the... Um, who is it? Pondu... He's running alongside. He must be thinking, where are you going? Game, hasn't he, in fairness? Forward, forward, forward. Ooh. The ball played forward here. Trying to pick out Nascimento. He's done remarkably well. Can he shoot? Can he finish? The referee has blown up here. Offside. Yeah, come on, Sean. Here comes Coletta. Infield he goes. Might be the chance to shoot. He's yeah. dragged it wide. Plays it forward up towards Nascimento. Palace have got it in midfield, very oh, elegant he's again, he's done well here, Raymond slots the ball forward, might be able to use his pace, does oh, use his pace, good play. save from the goalie, I think he's inside, the flag's up anyway. Flag's up, yeah. Go and go, 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 oh, that's a foul. Ball played infield here, Rashawn Mathurin's got the chance to run towards the edge of the 18-yard box, still going, squares up the defender, goes on the outside Excellent. and scores what's going to prove to be a crucial goal tonight, beats the goalkeeper, and that's a wonderful finish from Matthew Rand. Crystal Palace 3, Wolverhampton Wanderers nil. Well, it's an excellent finish. And, you know, just when I was saying he's a bit rusty, probably, you know, he's going to have to play his way in. He seizes an opportunity here. Drags. Right, now he's going to the big centre off. Can you shimmy? Little drop of the shot. And then the goalkeeper's just wrong-footed. Towards Coletta. Coletta over the halfway line. Oh, that's good. Good. Chris Francis dealt with that. There we go. And there goes the full time whistle. The referee has seen enough. Three appears to be the magic number. Oliver got three at the weekend. Darren Powell's kept it going tonight. Enjoy your evening, Palace fans.